small town of Huffingen in the southern Black Forest. For more than 20 years, the state-approved health resort has been tackling the issues of sustainability and climate action. The construction of the kindergarten in the district of Sumforen was a major highlight. The old building had to be demolished, there wasn't enough space and the building was also in a very bad state. The residents of Huffingen knew they wanted to build something that was environmentally friendly and create a sustainable building for the children. The idea for this project took two main aspects into account for the new construction of the kindergarten. One was to ensure the building is entirely pollutant-free, so the building materials don't contain any harmful substances. And the second aspect was that the building was designed to use a minimum amount of energy for heating. When it came to pollutant-free building materials, the project manager set the bar quite high. The materials were chosen according to the criteria of an interregional project for green building. This meant using local timber as the basic building material and insulation consisting of cellulose made from recycled paper. That helps protect both the environment and the children's health, seeing they spend a lot of time here. As a passive house, the building requires less heating energy. This is mainly obtained from passive sources such as the lamps, electrical appliances and the playing children themselves. At sub-zero temperatures, the air is also heated by a heat exchanger. Incidentally, the air is pollen and dust-free, an advantage for those suffering from allergies and asthma. Moreover, an efficient soil water heat pump was installed, which supplies the underfloor heating. We have a heat pump here which is ultimately fed through hoses which are laid in the garden, so ground collectors. There are 150 meters of ground collectors in place in the garden at a depth of around 1.2 meters. By using this renewable energy source, the kindergarten's heating system fits in perfectly with the climate-friendly building concept. The building is well insulated from below. In other words, the base plate, the building envelope, the roof, the window areas, the heating system with the ground collectors and the ventilation system with heat recovery. All of these elements created an optimal package, enabling us to construct the building from an ecological standpoint. The idea of such a climate-friendly building project went down well with the residents from the start. To get this challenging model project off the ground, the citizens lent a hand and put in over 700 volunteer hours. I think it's wonderful that the new building is located where the old schoolhouse used to stand. We're in the center of Sumforen. With this new kindergarten, Hufingen saves more than five tons of CO2 a year, and it already serves as a role model in the region. Other municipalities shall now follow their example. The main thing we achieved was to demonstrate that public buildings can be built in a green and energy efficient way without creating huge additional expenses. We simply wanted to set an example with that. The fact that a little extra effort pays off in the long term is obvious. Climate action also pays off for the children, the teachers and the parents. They benefit every day from an entirely user-friendly building.